Topping our news today at noon, safety for student athletes and fans on the field. With the state of Florida ranking number one in the country for lightning strikes, one Suncoast school is making their students' well being a very top priority. ABC 7's Rebecca Vargas joins us now with more on the story. Rebecca? Well, Scott, a newly installed lightning detection system has become a reality due to a generous donation from a family who's taking their tragedy and using it to protect lives across the state. Bradenton Christian School has just installed a $10,000 weather bug lightning detection system on campus next to the baseball and football field. It's the same system used by the NFL and the MLB at every stadium. The system was donated by the Jesse Watlington Foundation, which was created by the parents of a 12 year old boy who was killed in a lightning strike during football practice. When lightning is detected in the area, this system sounds an alarm that can be heard within a 500 yard radius and emails administrators and teachers. It also sounds an alarm giving the all clear 30 minutes after the last lightning strike is recorded. The foundation is donating donating 50 of these systems to private schools around the state who would otherwise not be able to afford initial installation, all with the goal of protecting students. We just want to make sure that our little boy Jesse is the last child needlessly struck by lightning in the state of Florida. Public schools, they have the benefit of getting their donations you know, through state and local government. For us, it, it is the ability to go from an antiquated, battery-operated handheld unit that you're never quite sure how accurate it is to a state-of-the-art computer-driven uh, radar detection system that allows ultimately for us to make decisions uh, for the safety of our kids with uh, taking the guesswork out of it. Now after the first year, Bradenton Christian will continue to pay $1,500 annually for the weather bug system monitoring. Scott, back to you.